It was wonderful to come back to our clone and the night of opening exhibition, it was great to see so many of my past pupils, past teachers, and we celebrated up in the hotel afterwards, which was great. It was a great night and a wonderful gallery to, to exhibit in. A beautiful light, a beautiful space, and I hope it won't be my last. If you start thinking about what, you, what, what I'm, if I th start thinking about what I'm doing, it kind of interrupts the flow of, so it's mostly uh, one has to be very free in themselves, not thinking, and very relaxed, and you know, let it go, whatever it is, not in a very control, or trying to be representational anyway. This, I think, is possibly my favourite painting of all the paintings I've done. Um, I just don't know why, but it it's somehow or other says what I wanted to say about music and musicians. Um, I like, again, it started with completely something different, and I kind of get involved in it and get stuck in there, and I completely forget what I'm doing. I didn't try to paint musicians. another emerging from behind it. There's another face up here. And there, there's another one down here. So I feel it was something within myself that I was touching into generations. So I call it generations. And this will be the more emerging of the more recent one. The brighter one emerging from that form, which is emerging from that form, which is also emerging again from another form. a lot of feeling I think in that picture. It's quite emotional. You wonder what questions he's asking. 
and what she wants to know or what she wants to tell. She's, um, I think, a cheeky little one. She's um, th thought, thoughtful. Again, if you notice the different parts, there's no effort to make a mouth there. It's just one little spot of paint and little spots of paint around here. But there's no, um, you see, the camera could take a picture of a little girl, but this is about the feelings of this little girl. Again, she's very thoughtful. She has a lot to say, I think, but she's um, maybe is waiting for somebody to listen to her.